We do require you to upload these in a certain sequence because B2C, uh, as you probably learned in the previous sessions, it's built on a hierarchical sense. So the base file is always going to be the largest file. It's going to have all the guts in it and we can give you all of those goodies up front. So if I went to base file, you can see here on the, on the right screen, it's pretty heavy, right? A lot of stuff going on. So the extension file will inherit everything that's in the base and the Reliant Party file here, which are these three guys, they'll, they'll inherit anything that's an extension, which inherits from the base. So if we upload it, we upload it out of sequence. I'll just kind of show you what happens there. It'll start yelling at you. And, and the reasoning for that, it's making references that don't exist. It's like when you, if you created software and you try to do reference a class that doesn't exist, that doesn't exist. What are you talking about, crazy person? See here, I don't have any policies, but if I upload policy, we do have an option to override, which we'll do that later when we, when we make updates. I'll click here. Again, I like to be consistent, so we'll go ahead and go back to that file. I'll copy this, sit it in here, back to where I need to be. Let's say I upload extension, because when I go to upload it, I'm going to get this nice little error. And this error is pretty much saying, hey, you're, you reference a base file and it can't be found. And that's because, like, base file has, doesn't exist. What I need to do, I need to go ahead and upload the base file first. And it should accept it, ideally. Now there's other er reasons why I could error, so we'll figure them out together. So the next one's gonna be extension. Upload this, and we wanna upload all of our Reliant parties. Which just go back to where we were at. Okay. And let's grab our Reliant Party. Other ones, which is the password reset and the profile edit. These are all my Reliant Parties. These are inheriting the extension and the base model. Profile edit should be my last one. You're getting a little toast notification. If I mess up anywhere, it'll yell at me. And like, say, if I did the XML error, I'll get those errors as I go to upload. It does show up, but if you go to the Toast Notification, this is where you're going to see all your errors. If not, it'll kind of fade away. I should have my five policies there. So let's go ahead, click on one of these. I believe the next step is to go ahead and test the 